What's up guys, it's Koi from Gentleman Within, a channel dedicated to helping men dress better and feel their best. And in this video, I'm going to be reviewing these Beckett Simonon black low top sneakers. So these are the Beckett Simonon Reed black low top sneakers. They also have it in all white and then a brown as well. They have multiple colorways for most of the shoes that they offer. These are the third pair of Beckett Simonon shoes that I own. The first being the Navy Morgan trainers, the German Army trainers, and the Black Dean Oxford. And so here's to hoping that these sneakers are gonna hold up as well as the other sneakers have. Quick introduction on Beckett Simonon. They're an online retailer that actually originally started with a Kickstarter campaign, but they've come a long way since then. They currently operate on a made to order business model, which means that they hold no inventory. Everything is manufactured in-house, which allows for them to have control over production and also offer fair and ethical working conditions. You place the order, they craft the goods, and then several months later, you get your products. It's a similar business model to Gustin in that they crowdsource and then they deliver at wholesale prices. For my order, I went through the entire three month process. And so I got to experience the entire Becca Simonon experience where they send you bi-weekly emails documenting the entire process from when you order it to the time when the shoes arrive on your doorstep. You're assigned a dedicated brand representative and they just send you updates, letting you know that your leather has been sourced and now they're cutting the leathers and they're gonna be stitching the leather. So they give you updates, they send you pictures, and they check in with you if you have any questions or concerns. If you wanna know more about the entire Beckett Simonon experience, I have a blog post over my blog, so I'll link that up there in the description for you guys so you can check that out. But what you're here for is the review, so let's jump right in with the shoe packaging. For the packaging, the Reed Black Low Tops come in a red maroonish shoe box with floral print on the lid. After opening the box, you're gonna see two generously sized shoe bag inserts. Also included are two black foam sole inserts for extra cushion and added support. Pretty clean packaging and unboxing. For the style and design of the shoes, the shoes are very minimal and clean, so they are very similar to a silhouette of the Common Project's Achilles or the Coil Capri sneakers that I recently unboxed. There's no decorations or embellishments, just a modern silhouette. I decided to go with the black leather with the white sole because it's something a little different from everything that I have. I already have a pair of white sneakers. I just wanted to mix it up a bit with a nice black pair that I can wear in the daytime and then transition effortlessly into a nighttime. The design is modern with a slim profile. There are some sneakers that have a bulkier sole, but the Becca Simonon Reload Top is a truly minimalist sneaker. The shoes are perfect to pair with all kinds of casual outfits. I'd go as far as to say that you can even pair it with lots of more smart casual looks as well. For the quality and craftsmanship, the shoe construction is pretty solid. Upon inspection, I couldn't find any visible imperfections with the leather or stitching. The shoes are pretty clean all around, which shows shows that their quality control is on point. And it makes sense since they own their own factory and they have full control over the process. The Beckett Simonon leather upper is made of full grain calfskin leather sourced in Italy from Gruppo Mistrato, a tannery with a long tradition and a great reputation. They also supply some high-end shoes in the $300 and $400 range. The leather is meant to be durable and develop a patina as it ages. For the lining and insoles, the shoes are completely lined with Vachetta leather, Vachetta leather. And so the inside of the shoe is incredibly soft. It's made with a breathable material that's supposed to provide comfort and durability. The shoes also come with these foam inserts that are pretty handy, super comfortable, and it just gives you a little bit of extra cushioning. And if the shoe is a little bit loose on you, it'll kind of tighten up the shoe as well. For the soles, the rubber is not made of the usual Margom rubber that shoes like Common Projects and other luxury sneakers use. They use their own rubbers, which are made of all natural rubber and it's not artificial. For the laces, they are waxed cotton laced sneakers. And so they're easy to tie and they stay put when you tie them. And the laces are black to match the black leather. For the comfort and durability, I've got to say that these shoes are super comfortable right out of the box, buttery soft on the inside. And then when you add on that insole, it adds even more comfort to the sneakers. I've worn them for about two weeks. I know it's not a long testing period, but they wear really nicely. Thankfully, there's no squeaking and the leather Leather is creasing normally as leather shoes would. The creasing did appear early on, which kind of surprised me, but it hasn't been creasing any much more than it already has. And so it's pretty consistent. So far, so good. And when I get to wear these extensively, I'll have to do an update video. For shoe sizing and price, generally Becca Simonon shoes run true to size. And so I'm normally a size seven and a half, but they didn't have that size when I ordered. So I got the eight which is a little bit loose on me. There's a little extra room in the back of the heel when my foot is slid all the way to the front. I would say to be safe, order true to size. So if you're an eight, get an eight. 
or you can go a half size down to seven and a half. But I think with that shoe insert, it really does help with the fit. It's good that they produce a small amount of extra supply just in case you need to exchange or switch it up to a different size. As for the sneaker width, I'd say that it fits a little bit more wide than narrow, but it's pretty standard width. And so if you have normal sized feet, your feet are gonna fit comfortably. My feet are a little bit wider than narrow, but there's still plenty of room in these shoes. Finish things off with some Beckett Simonon pros and cons. So for the pros, the full Beckett Simonon experience is unmatched. Go on my blog and read more about that. The sneakers have a sleek and slim modern silhouette. It's high quality full grain calfskin leather that's ethically sourced from Italy. They have new designs that are frequently updated based on user feedback. They offer many different colorways to choose from and there are free shipping and free returns. The cons, of course, is that three month wait period. It's so long that sometimes I forget that I even ordered the shoes. But if you can wait, you know, it's well worth it. And I noticed that sometimes shoes and products just disappear from the site without any notice or mention that they're going to be restocking and so it just kind of vanishes and you have no idea where your favorite pair of shoes or bomber jacket went. Line, so far so good with the Beckett Simonon Reed sneakers. I love the color, I love the style, the design, the aesthetic. It looks great with lots of casual looks. It's definitely a pair of shoes that I will wear year round. It is worth noting that these black reeds are no longer in stock and I believe that they're going to be discontinuing the reeds after the supply of the all white trainers are gone and so i have links you can check out the all white trainers but i believe they're going to be gone after this last run but most likely they're going to replace the reeds with maybe the albas or a new pair of sneakers as always you can use my code gent within and get 20 percent off your beckett simonon order so if this is a brand that you've been waiting to try out now is a great opportunity so i'm going to provide links down below so go ahead put that code in and you know, tell them that I sent you. All right, so thank you as always for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new here, please consider subscribing, put out new videos like this weekly. That's all I got for this video. Cheers to your style, and I will catch you on the next one. Peace.